You don't really know much about Halloween. And welcome back to another unboxing video. I am Joel of the Newly Deads. Um, if you're on this channel, you probably already know that. But um, if you'd like to find out more about us, uh, my wife and I are content creators. Uh, we love everything spooky. Uh, you can check us out at thenewlyduds.com. You can find out about our, uh, we have two blogs that we write. Uh, we do um, other movie reviews. We have a television show. Uh, we also have a podcast. And uh, we also have events that we go to because we are artists. So we go sell our wares at uh, um, uh, various events in the area. So go check that out. Uh, if you'd like to reach us, you can reach us at contact at thenewlydeads.com to find out um, anything you'd like to know. Questions, comments, concerns, you can reach us there. You can also go to our Facebook page and um, sign up, uh, you know, like the page, sign up. There's nothing to sign up. You can just like the page. Um, we put out a lot of content for um, anything like spooky, horror, uh, etc as well as information about anything that's going on for us. So it's kind of a real-time update as far as what we're doing. So that is another great way to interact with us. And we love meeting new people. So go check it out, hit us up, say hello. And um, yeah, so this is only one thing uh, as far as what I'm unboxing, but it's kind of a big thing. And it's a, if, you're, if you're into uh, old kung fu movies, you've probably already seen a hundred other people do the unboxing of this, but I could not talk about it. Um, so first of all, Severin always sends stickers. I really like this one in particular, just the, the color choices on it just hit that sweet spot for me. Um, and what we're here to talk about today is the Game of Clones, the uh, uh, the Bruce Bloitation Collection Volume 1, which I'm a Bruce Lee fan. Uh, I have the Criterion uh, box set, and I have heard about a lot of these. I'm I'm sure I've come across a couple of them in the course of my lifetime. I'm coming up on 50 in a few months. And so, you know, I grew up watching these on you know, various stations as a kid. Um, this happens to be the uh, impossibly limited uh, bonus disc version, which also includes two additional movies, uh, The Big Boss Part 2 and The Black D Dragon versus The Yellow Tiger. So uh, I was excited to find that out because... You know, hey, who doesn't like extra movies? Um, so this is an amazing set. It's a very simple, you know, it's fairly small, a fairly slim box. Uh, so it'll fit nicely on a shelf. And if there are going to be more sets, which apparently there are most likely. And from what I can gather just from what I read online and what I see, uh, this has been a very popular release, maybe even one of the best of the year. We'll find out. Um, but I, basically, I rather than go through every individual film one by one and you know tell you all about each one because that would be here all day um there because there's 14 uh restored films plus the two additional so 16 total i believe if i remember correctly um i'll just read you what what uh severin put on their site so they said hours after bruce lee's death bruce exploitation was born and for the next 10 years talented martial artists were enlisted to mimic iconic aspects of lee's lifestyle and mannerisms uh, fueled by equal parts deception and demand, these films instead created one of the most wildly entertaining subgenres in movie history. I would concur. Uh, the Game of Clones, Bruce 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 Bloitation Collection Volume One now presents fourteen of the very best and frequently very bizarre films starring Bruce Lai, Bruce Lay, Dragon Lee, Bruce Lang, and more. All restored for the first time ever from original elements. Then, in the fascinating gem of a documentary. Uh, that's a quote from Culture Mix. Enter the Clones of Bruce Lee uh, is also included here, which is done by director Gary uh, David Gregory, who tracks down the surviving Bruces, along with martial arts legends, producers, directors, distributors, historians, and more, to reveal the entire shocking and bittersweet saga behind a celluloid phenomenon that refuses to die. 
Um, so it's eight discs. Um, it includes the documentary, a uh, hundred page book with essays, posters, and rare photos. Um, all over 24 combined hours of special features. That's a lot of special features in this little box. So this features uh, the clones of Bruce Lee, Enter the Three Dragons, Enter the Game of Death, Goodbye Bruce Lee, his last game of death, The Dragon Lives Again, Bruce and the Iron Finger, Challenge of the Tiger, Cameroon Connection, uh, Super Dragon, the Bruce Lee story, uh, The Dragon Lives, The Dragon the Hero, Rage of the Dragon, and then as I mentioned, uh, Big Boss Part 2 and the Black Dragon versus Yellow Tiger. So this is not something you're going to get through in a day. This is something that's going to take some effort to <laughs> break the back of, so to speak. So it's a beautiful box. Uh, you've got this just fantastic artwork um, that, you know, gives you a lot of little little shots of, of uh, different aspects of the film, different characters, different stories. So I'm not a huge fan of this type of, of casing. I understand why it's done, uh, but I always worry about, you know, potentially damaging the disc. So you always have to be kind of careful going into this. And I can guarantee that in this set, you're going to hear a lot of, Whoa! I can't do it. My voice is not going to go high enough today. Um, but uh, it's, it just, it just looks like it's going to be a, a big bucket of fun. Um, and I, I think it's something that is wonderful about a lot of these blue, boutique Blu-ray labels is that they're taking stuff that a lot of people thought of kind of as uh, just a quick way to make a buck, trash, um, you know, just fodder for the masses, ways to get people in, in asses and seats, which in a way it was, but it also has a, a lot of merit. And a lot of times there's a lot of other stuff going on uh, that kind of gets overlooked because of the fact that it's kind of considered as secondary entertainment, which is unfortunate. Um, this is the, what's housing the extra disc. So, you know, if you don't have the extra disc collection, you just have this nice little pocket, uh, where this would go. Now, I don't know what the, uh, limited, limited quantity is on that, but, um, then you've got this, this lovely little book here. Again, that includes photos of uh, various, uh, Bruce exploitation actors. Um, try and be careful here because I don't want to make my mic go wonky, but, uh, you've got just, again, this, this, as I mentioned, this beautiful book that if you like to do a deep dive into, uh, you know, various aspects of the film and I won't, you know, go through every single page here, but, uh, then you've got some essays, you've got a lot of, you know, posters and, and screenshots and, uh, there's a lot to dig into here. So. You know, this isn't just a, uh, a visual kind of experience. There is a lot to absorb. And hopefully, or ideally, by the end of all this, you will be an expert on Bruce exploitation, And that's just in time for Volume 2 to come out, which I, I just have this gut feeling that there's no way that's not going to happen. Um, with as popular as the Shaw uh, Scope collection has been, now that his, uh, Volume 3 has been announced and is on the way, uh, there's no way that... that uh, there's not going to be more of this. So Severin, uh, beautiful job. I'm, I'm so excited to, to dig into this. And um, it's kind of making me want to go back to the original uh, Bruce Lee Criterion collection and, and can keep on rolling with that because I uh, still haven't quite gotten all the way through it. There's just so much stuff out there to watch. Uh, it tends to be a little overwhelming, as those of you who are uh, movie aficionados know, especially if uh, you collect boutique Blu-rays. It's a never-ending habit. It's kind of like drugs, but more expensive. <laughs> I don't know. Probably not more expensive. Depends on what you're doing. Anyway, that's it. I'm done. Time to take a break. Um, and uh, we'll be back soon with more unboxing content for you. And just remember that tomorrow is not guaranteed. So don't forget to unbox your heart. We'll see you soon. Halloween, the festival of Sauron. Happy Halloween.